Does height matter in a man? Yeah. But you know guys can't change that. Sounds like a what personal problem. A personal problem? Yeah. Well, let's see how you look without makeup. We're gonna judge you based on unnatural beauty. No. But you can change that. What did I just yeah, give me my face to go out tonight? Why? You trying to change your appearance? No, everyone wears makeup. So let me judge you based on something you can change. Let me judge you. As a shorter guy, yeah. I think she's totally shallow. Let me know what y'all think. I said, God help me. Help me to live. Let me tell you something else. You and people that spread hate in the name of God children every day. Do you know how many kids take their lives because of people like you? Exactly. Instead of knowing what God is and who exactly. he is, That's right. all they feel is hate and shame. Exactly. And you're exactly. never gonna save anybody with that. Exactly. So listen, it's not it's not the message of Jesus that people commit suicide about. It's actually the, yeah. the, the Bible says that you sin separates us from you God, because you didn't and sin that actually you allows didn't sin you allows didn't unclean that. spirits to torment people, and people oh, okay. there are spirits of su that people actually commit su because of demons, demons. But the message of Jesus is you can be free from the sin and the demons that are trying to get people to. Themselves. People who spread hate in the name of God aren't true followers of God. Why do you think we have the expression nice guys finish last? Um, because a lot of people like overlook their like if you have a friend and he's like so sweet to you and you might not think that he is your uh, would like go for him like that then you might just like look over him oh he's just a friend but really he was the person who would like always like treat you the way you wanted to be treated okay. even if they're like kind of a pushover a little bit i think women definitely like dominance probably because they take too long like to um secure the bag i guess like secure the girl but with bad boys they're just like i, I want this that's it well what do women find attractive about a bad boy the dominance yeah that might come with like emotional abuse and like stuff like that but like so a lot of women like to be dominated i think this woman actually had a valid reason nice guys might take too long to secure the bag the mechanic shop that my dad works in that okay. he is too afraid to ask for a raise because he knows he'll get told no and what does he do at that point does he does he stay in a job that says you're not worth anymore or does he continue to go around our small little town and go back to working at hardy's or the non-existent other mechanic shop. What I say is that folks like that should get together with their other employees. They are a lot, we, you do realize we have a right to unionize, right? Uh, yes. Okay, so then what are you fighting for, man? Because like, I- People you, unionizing. That's legal under the National Labor yes. Relations Board law. So do you have anything against unionizing? I have everything against government unions, but if private unions exist, which they do, whether the United, United Auto Workers Union, which you might disagree with their policies, but it's perfectly legal. So it seems like you're, you're cool with, like, the laws, man. In other words, it seems like you represent that you stand for nothing. Can this be a respectful quit? Like, thank you for everything. Wait, wait, you can't just I'm leave. I'm not, like, gonna go, yeah, I'm not crying. I, I'm tired. That's you're why. You're tired? Yeah, I've been up since, like, 3 in the morning. Okay, but at least, okay, look, you provided okay, a lot of no, notes. Tell you what, I will, hold on, like, I will fast track. This has been really great. No, you can't defend your world for you. I think you're a coward, to be honest. Okay. I think it's cowardly for you to quit because... You've been absolutely demolished by Andrew. You provided this is what a lot of notes. When liberals get angry and get called out. I mean, this is. I mean, wrong. she 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 said that women don't have equal rights under the Constitution. I don't understand okay. the point of coming on the podcast if you know what you're Guns getting blazing. into, and then you're just gonna leave. We but can we look up the bright side? We can talk she about. She took up a lot of space on that side of the table. Like. Now we can room. talk about anything. Just... This is some pick me attitude if I ever seen it. But with that level of immaturity, I would just let her go. Class. Oi, oi, oi! Okay, all right, thank y'all. We're gonna go ahead and work on. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh! You're being too loud. You need to calm down. Oh, that's not. That's not gonna work. No, don't clap. You're supposed to be quiet. Alright, um, Thank you. Thank you. Class, class. 
Yeah, you gotta be brand new out in cringe to attract the Gen Z mind. Yeah, the gaslighting is insane. Bro is absolutely sick of her. This man is currently breaking the internet after he was kicked off his flight because of his t-shirt with President Donald Trump on it and a Hokta meme reference. Apparently, right before he boarded, a Delta staff member walked up to him and told him that somebody complained about his t-shirt. So he decided to turn it inside out and everybody got on the plane fine. Right before takeoff, for some reason, another employee walked up to him and said, Nope, you're done. You're cooked. Get off the plane. Genuinely so silly. What do you think? That shirt is pretty nice. If something, he should be getting extra good treatment for it. So you don't believe in trans rights or gay rights? No. Why not? All I believe in, if you are born with a c you are a man for the rest of your life. If you're a guy and you're cutting your dick off to become a woman, you're an idiot because you're missing out on free hand warmers in between your legs. Okay, so why do you think that people are transgender then? Like, why is that a thing? It's all for attention. All these people that are saying they have pronouns, he, her, she, them, it's all for fucking attention. So I'll tell you what, my pronouns are she, them. Let me she, them. So how was your childhood growing up? Like, did you have a father or a mother? Yeah, I had a mother that beat my ass if I talked back to. That's why we have to bring back the bell. Growing up, if I ever talked back to my mother, she would drag me by my fucking hair and pull me down the steps. So you believe in bullying? 1,000%. If bullying was around, all the shit that's happening in this generation that's making it suck wouldn't be happening. Were you bullied? I was bullied. Because guess what? It builds character. Bullying builds character. It's an absolute valid opinion and belief to have. You can't make us all believe in your shenanigans. Okay, so I keep getting asked if I am transitioning, why am I pregnant when that's such a woman thing to do? Well, yeah. Pregnancy in itself is not like a feminine woman thing for me. That doesn't make sense. That doesn't take away from like mothers who are pregnant and go through motherhood. Of course it does. For them, that is a woman thing. That is a feminine woman experience for them. For me, it's not because I'm not a woman and when I'm pregnant, I'm still not a woman. Are you sure about that? I never in my life seen a man get pregnant. Neither did you and neither did anybody on earth. Do you think Bi the Biden-Harris administration did a good job of recovering the economy? Yes, uh, I do. I, I think every country in the world virtually envies the U.S. economy. I understand why many people here feel uncomfortable about high prices and other aspects. But one should remember where we were in January of 2021. Yeah, okay buddy, if you support and appreciate what I do, I suggest you to like, subscribe, and comment down below for the algorithm. I appreciate the goodness of all, and I'ma see you all on the next video.